When Darwin ran into the marine iguana, he remarked that they're the most disgusting, clumsy lizards. He dissected a few of them and found that they ate marine algae almost exclusively, which he thought was super weird. In fact, they only exist on the Galapagos Islands and are the only marine lizard in the world, so are unique in their ability to forage at sea. Their stunted-ass pug faces let them get right up close to algae-covered rock and snack away. They get these crusty fucking faces because they ingest a bunch of salt eaten underwater. It gets filtered through their blood, ends up at exocrine glands in their nostrils, and they sneeze it out. Even though young Darwin knew they'd go to the water to eat, he chased one to the water's edge and it never jumped in no matter what he did. He thought that interesting too, like, maybe they don't jump in because on land they don't have significant predators, but at sea they have to contend with sharks and shit. So he hucked one as far as he could into the sea, and it came back to the same spot he hucked it from over and over. I don't know what he learned from that one, but it's interesting.